all right folks welcome back and this time my first coalition edition video Lens discovery also thanks thank you ali oh my God. huge thanks to ali for helping me out uh, my game runs on 60 fps now like holy hell dude the smoothness ah uh, yes now it's fun to play <laughs> Yes, man. Thanks, thanks, Ali. It's it's one of her her old um, solution to this problem with new newer GPUs. Uh, I checked it out, and um, yes, man. Yes, we are back in business. And I started to record on 60 FPS immediately. <laughs> All right, so Omega 52, aka New Moscow. I wonder why they still didn't fi uh, rename that, but uh. We got ourselves a saboteur coalition heavy fighter. It looks like the insurgent. Also, by the way, we have wings down ships now, man. You guys know how I have been fighting for these ships for years. Ah, uh, they are amazing, man. These are the intro ships from Freelancer Intro when they raid uh, Alliance. You know, settlements and such. And, uh, man, these are great. And let's just kill this Corsair. Let's celebrate that. Also, I use faster weapons because I was lagging, like I said. I had that 30 FPS, which was really stupid. And uh, now that I'm a little bit faster, I would actually go for 3.03 guns. And the um, 3.03 refire rate um, Dragonovs. Because that's what I used um, in my earlier days. That was my mix, so to say. I'm not sure if my old. Um, My old thing will work though, my old uh, combination with whatever. Anyhow, we have scat we have chain guns guys. Freaking kinetic guns. You see this? This is beautiful man. I was I was waiting for guns like these. Cause there's this one thing. Like let's say you bring this person to a uh, low level like this and he has no more hull left I mean no more nanobots and such you can just uh, like <laughs> ram his butt with um, freaking maximum ah oh, alley yes okay uh, yeah with those maximum chain guns <coughs> which is pretty amazing and uh, it's it's like a finisher gun. Like he has a, a little bit of health left. Just just finish it. All right. So finally, switch to guns. We've uploaded the mission waypoint into. To it for more instructions. Yes. Is these really pack a punch? Like, look at that. 1055 shield damage. <laughs> we have another SRA online. That's uh, Ziliath. You guys know him. Another trick is, if you cruise, cruise ant and kill engine and see my power is refilling, so you can 
go with uh, incense sweep. Okay. Anyhow, I need to get used to these um, 3.3 guns again, though. But they do a lot of damage. Like, you know, that's that's a that's a cool thing. That's what I like about that. Oh, really? I have to return it. Yeah, you know what? Let's return it. I would actually like to, like, switch two of them to 5.88. Hmm. I might actually do that, because... Because these ones don't have a lot of range. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to do two uh, class one. So they have approximately the same range, and the guns are a bit faster. Together with the um, shield poster, and let me see how that works works out. Let's see. Also, you'll have a chain firing. You know, that's that's another cool thing. Well, let me see if I can. Uh, one. Yep. There we go. There we go. Yeah, another mission. Another mission, another mission. Three on forty. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Like Kamchatka had much better missions, like in Omega 55. Also, they were a lot more near to the base. Hmm. Oh, we have a VI. By the people of the Okay, I'm gonna show you what I meant with uh, the kill engine thing again. <coughs> like, if you are in cruise and um, kill engine, then, like, uh, you have like one second to, like, um, how should I say that? Disable kill engine and kill engine again. You know, you don't uh, you lose your speed, but your available power will raise, and you're still in that juicy speed. Speed, speed. I mean, whoa, that's a whoa. Okay, that's a wild. You're gonna throw wilds at me. Okay, so anyway, um, yeah, you see why I why I went with. Two AK1, AK1, and because you see, that's that's the nice thing. Uh, you can aim and uh, have a chain firing. Yeah, I like that. I like this combination. There we go. Uh, duh. Also, those kinetic weapons, chain gun, they don't deal any damage. Uh, they, they don't use any power. So while while your power is regening, you can use a uh, chain gun. That's another uh, cool thing. Addition, so to say. So while your uh, power is kind of like, you know, oh shit. Like you see right now, we're going with chain power, uh, cha chain gun, and once I have powers full, I'll go back to flashy pops. Unless those wraiths are really. Yeah, I hit. Rhineland ships are one of those that are really hard to hit. They were really OP back in their time. Okay, don't tell me. Don't ask me why I did that. Okay. Okay. 
There we go. I actually wanted to uh, swap to a insurgent because um, I love the insurgent, but the, the thing is, it doesn't have a second uh, slot for for you know the maximum chain gun. That's why I like the saboteur, and the saboteur is a little bit fast still. So we did it a couple missions, but uh, there is there isn't much to do right now as SCRA. However, we have uh, Wogrod Industrial Comrade online right now. So I'm gonna hop over to my um, Whoa, wait a second. Thousand, okay, 2.00. Yeah. Gonna hop on into my transport. Okay, so here we are with my VI transport. We are using Pilgrim liners, because because of them them being so old and such, they, it looks perfectly, it, it fits the coalition theme. Uh, I picked that ship long ago. Uh, everyone agreed, and we went with that as convoys and such. And uh, since then, are using this ship actually as a main traditional ship. However, we wish to get a coalition transport, of course, one day, but. Um, That'll take a while, so... Uh, yeah, that other guy I think left. So I know many of you <coughs> will probably say, hey... Snake, uh, unlawful mining... That's like so annoying right now. And I'm gonna be like, yeah, you're right, it's, it's kinda annoying, but uh... There are... Um, let's say holes maybe uh, you can use like as example gold ore we have allies we have allies as coalitions coalitioners uh, keep that in mind keep that always in mind we have allies so like mollies mollies can give us gold ore we used to trade gold ore and um so, also gold ore is, um, has a good sell point on Kyoto, which was a block dragon uh, base. And you guys know we did um, role play with block dragons to get them friendly, green, so we can dock on their bases. So you can sell things there. You can get helium three, maybe. Okay, we had a couple RP with. GMG but like we didn't extend it so I don't know they might be against it but you know you could get helium 3 ore and then transport it to apparently Akabat, planet Akabat, Omicron Mu to order we are we are friendly with order again you know allies so you can dock on their bases then you can get camber munitions we made a pack we made a deal that we um, trade camera munitions and our Volgograd ordinance so there are a couple sell points you can sell them for a good thing like as example camber munitions is good sold in Dublin in Iron Moor base so you can imagine you have a circle there you have a circle there like old or to Kyoto in Chugoku then you go to Sigma 59 get helium 3 and go to Omicron Mu through Tohoku and eventually back to Dublin. Of course, are there other ways to trade? Yes, but they the the earning is really low. Like you know, if you would just do camera munitions and Volgograd ordinance alone, that's uh, yeah, that's gonna be that's gonna suck. But uh, ore mining is actually good here. Also, don't mind the musics. The musics aren't from the original Discovery. I, I swapped the Omega soundtracks with uh, my old Star Lancer musics. Because I used... 
we were we were doing Omega House, like an Omega Union role play, which we were like in, enforcing laws and such with coalition red Hessians and mollies. Uh, we were patrolling Omegas all over the place, and then I was like, "Holy shit! Okay, this feels like a nation, like you know, coalition nation." Uh, and uh, I, I used the soundtracks on all three, also to to not trigger the anti cheat, you know. You can't you can't add the music separately. I did that once, and uh, it triggers the anti cheat. But uh, if you just swap the existing um, soundtracks, that's no problem. That doesn't cause anything. Okay, so I'm trying to find the golden coin. Should be somewhere around here, and. Uh, I'm not sure if um, you can dock there as a normal coalitioner or because the thing is our VI tag right now ain't the official one so the official one is still it's, it has been requested but uh, there is still no answer um, <clears throat> so I'm not sure maybe our official tag is in that golden corn POB so let's see let's see because that's the thing with golden coin if, if we don't have any mollies to mine you just go to that POB and buy uh, gold ore so but I have to check where it is oh it's it, it's it's neutral is it? No. Oh, okay, that's... I got happy too early. Okay. Uh, where is the base? It should, it should have been somewhere around here. Oh, there it is. Ooh, it's wet. It's wet. I'll see if it's supposed to attack me. Let's see if the weapon platforms attack us. And how does it look like? I don't see the I don't see the weapon platforms. Oh 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 oh, oh there we are. Oh okay 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 okay. okay. Oh, okay wow 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 okay that's 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 not that's not what we wanted. Oh uh, it's shooting serps. Okay run away. Okay we have to clarify that with mollies, <laughs> or we have to get our old tag back. <laughs> Let's see about that. All right, folks. So after setting up all the shits, um, okay, we got a miner. We got a molly miner joining us, and uh, hopefully we'll get some gold ore and um, make our way to either Vogtland or, I mean, Vogtland in German. But um, eat that, or we go to Kyoto and try to get some helium three. But I will see about that. Well, he said he's going to be around here. A server die or something? Oh, he's on his way. Okay, there we go. Okay, these are the um, independent gold fields, it seems. <laughs> don't do three things at the same time, my boy. Just don't do it. <laughs> so this is unlawful trading, guys, by the way. This is totally un unlawful. You know, we're a, co we're a coalition transport um, company, so to say. Uh, so, <laughs> docking for us is really hard. But uh, thanks to the progress of making allies in the past, we can dock on certain places.
Hey, there he is. Okay, I'm gonna skip this part ahead so you don't have to watch the mining procedure. All right, folks. We have a full cargo of gold ore. Now I'm not gonna do the um, Chugoku run because we don't have a response from the GMG folks. And um, once we have that, we can get Helium-3 and such. But uh, for now, we'll go to Vokton base, which is Dresden, and uh, sell our things there. All right, folks, we arrived at Vokland in Vokland in the Dresden system. Well, let's see how much money we get for this. For 25. Okay, I'll take 25. That's okay. We'll take lot diamonds back to Ronenberg. And there we have a small safe trading route. This is a safe one, like without helium 3 ore. I'm not sure <coughs> if we could get uh, uncut diamonds here. But, uh. So, yeah, I know, I'm not sure what the situation is on the uncut diamonds. I suppose it's a. Uh, I think the red Hessians have a perk to um, mine those. I'm not sure. Um, but I mean, if you don't have anyone, just get blood diamonds. So, uh, decent amount of cash too. So I think uh, going back and forth, you get around 40 million, I say. 40 million for this route. Um, and you have only one ore. We're bringing blood diamonds back to Ronenberg station in Omega 5. Also, the, uh, we didn't do the uh, long route. I'll, I'll record that, don't worry. Um, we'll get a shot on that route, that route, whatever. Um, which, you, which we go to Kyoto in Chugoku, sell the gold ore there, and, in, and get Helium 3 back to Newcastle. So this way, and uh, not Newcastle, but uh, Omicron Mu, who was, Order, uh, Planet, Akabat, and um, get Camber munitions back to Armor Station. That's that's another for another episode though. So let's finish this one first. Let's see how much we did in total. So we. Um, we use like we, we we paid two million for blood diamonds. So let's see for how much they sell, like a full car game. Alrighty, nine million, ten million, like eight million profit. Okay, let's say thirty-two million, thirty-five million. Uh. What else could we bring back to Dublin? Oh, we could bring sidearms to Dublin. Actually, let's do that. Or more base. Uh, wait, sidearms. Yeah, sidearms. Thermian, that was it. Actually, that's a round you do, and now you take another gold ore <coughs> cargo and <coughs> do the same shit again. And I think you get around 40 to 40 million. Let's say 40 million. And, um, but uh, it's a really short route, so you want to might want to do that if you're an unlawful a coalition or coalition transport, etc. But that's uh, the, all the time I've got for this episode. So thank you guys for watching, and see you guys on the next mission.